Welcome back to the channel everyone. Thanks for tuning in to another one here on the coach's desk. So the world's fastest man, the fastest man in the world this year, Kishane Thompson, 9.77 seconds, should have been in the event uh, this Sunday, actually today, where he would have been competing in the 100 meters at the meeting, League Nano. Um, however, the world's fastest man decided to withdraw from the event and I know the people are more come for me, especially the up north fans them because they believe that hey, me a, me a talk up withdrawal and you know. But see a next man a withdraw me not say nothing too much. But guess what? This man withdraw because he has what you'd call it has business to take care of. He has autograph to sign, and he had an exhibition race to run. With um some folks, you understand, and him do him exhibition race, you understand, and then him go sign him autograph and all of these things because you turn star. You get to me, I say. So of course these are part of the things that he's supposed to be doing. And yeah, him never withdraw because him have to do no extra training and all of these things. Plus, I from what I understand is that they would have arrived at um the part of where they are late, so you know they never want to go. Put in the running plus camp for going and all of these things. But other Jamaicans will be running at the event. Rowan Watson, Natasha Morrison, Tina Clayton, Christiana Williams. She ran um, at the meet. And of course, it is what it is. So before 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 we get into 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 the other results that took place, or just a few results, because we now touch everything. You understand? Um we have to talk about uh Two Jamaicans who ran Serena Cole, she was um in that one. She did eleven three nine to take the, the top prize in that one. Uh, Natasha Morrison did not start in this one. So that is what's up with Natasha Morrison. She has been seemed to be having a, a very torrid season, you know. So don't know what what is happening with Natasha, but she withdraw from that event as well, uh, for whatever reason. Um Christana Williams, she was second in eleven two eight. Um, in that one as oh, well she was second uh, behind the American um, Celera Barnes I didn't see any time for her on that one so let me not um, say that so a few Jamaicans Kemba Nelson she ran as well finish um, third in that event yeah so people 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 out there putting in the work you understand so good run from Kemba there but um, what we have to talk about, separate and apart from Kishin Thompson at 977, this youth, Benjamin, yeah man, this youth, Benjamin Richardson, the South African, see him? This man is the said man that defeated Tibogo in the last U20 when Tibogo was supposed to run away. Or we thought that Tibogo was supposed to run away with that. And this man show up and surprise Tibogo. See? Now he has emerged and him drop a 9.86. Mm-hmm. Dropping a 9.86. Positive 1.9 meters per second at the uh Lache Defense meeting. Yes. And that is very interesting because he's a joint sixth on the 100 meter list for 2024 and it's second quickest time by a South African in history. So this youth is the real deal. He's the truth. And it's a, a telling performance from him. And it just basically shake up the place where the sprinting is concerned, you know. You see it? It just shake up the place. I mean, um, Father Hyper go on him thing, Fred Curley, Kenny. Yeah. You have um the Italian reigning champion run 1008. You get to me, I say. You have, um, what's his name? The grass is coming back. Looking, not looking bad. So, work really are putting where sprinting is concerned. Male sprinting. Yeah, for him to reach 986 at this time. And of course, the Olympics is coming up. Um, expectation is for him to, you know, go a little bit faster. Yeah. So, he might be right in the morning. And them youth are young, raw, and rich in talent. And them now have the fear. See? So they are going to come out and try to ensure that they upset the apple cart. See? And we talk about experience. Yes, that is critical and important. But many champions, when they go on top of the podium, they didn't have no experience. 
So we don't want to use that experience something there, you know, because that experience something there can put one side, you know. In athletics, people always talk about paid dues and all of them something. There. A lot of athletes come to the fore and kick down the door and not and not take nothing. Um, what you call experience. Them not respect no athletes who have been there before. So that we are talking about man like Kishin, we are come kick down the door. You see me? I say so. We don't want the people them feel like say yo. Experienced people out there and experienced folks have it luck. Don't take it for granted. See, experience is good. It teaches wisdom. However, when the raw talent come to fusion and the raw speed come out and the people them yo know say them want get on the poor them comes what me them no business who experience them go out of the field and deal with it. See, so right now, Kishi and there. See that look you to emerge and now Benjamin. I have Thibaut over there still. Hey, listen. This year at the Olympics, great things are going to happen. Great things. We're going to have some very good running taking place. It's going to be one of the most exciting Olympic Games um, post bolt era. See? And that is good because a lot of people think that the sport die because bolt gone. No. See, another Jamaican come up here and start shake up the place. He's been talked about by many, many, many East, West, North and South. A lot have been talking about him. See? And right now, <laughs> yo, the man never pressure no lies, you know. Because the man never even has no lies. Not even have everything like in the 200 meters. Which means things say, the field has come close. But no, no, I still ahead. Now, if the field has come close and no, I still ahead. Me thinks that he's not able to champion at the 200. But people have said, no, look on Tibogo. Tibogo drag 19, 8 and all of them something there. And remember, Tibogo had the man with the, yo, the, the, the superior 400 speed and the film speed endurance might be superior to no allies. But don't forget, so no allies can run, can run the, um, the 4x4. Remember, I'm doing it at the indoor, you know. So they don't take no allies in terms of his sea speed endurance for granted. That's why at the end of the race, when people start decelerating, no allies just ready to kick in. And we call it top end speed. See? So, quite frankly, I, I believe Noah can hold on to the 200 slightly. But in the 100, in the 100, he's going to have it very, very challenging. See? People even say because I'm not paying more attention to the 200, the, the 100 meters in 200 a lock. So probably that's why I'm going back and spend another extra week to do the work. Um, you People need to understand that staying back an extra week to do work, it does more for the athlete than if them go up on the circuit or on a one half. That don't make no sense sometimes. Especially if you have things that you need to work on. One week of training, better than to travel for, 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 for go uh, 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 at a competition. Always better. So, I can't run now for that. But, him have more company. Can Benjamin forward. <laughs> People want to think. Drop a like on the video. Drop a comment in the comment section. I make we kind of have a conversation. See? Big up yourself. Big up the people them who from time to time comment on the video. Big up on yourself. We appreciate it. Until next time, stay safe now.